Hispanic small business owners are hopeful entrepreneurs spent their Saturday and hopeful entrepreneurs spent their Saturday learning. 22 News reporter Kate Walsh attended a seminar today on how to start and manage a business in Western Massachusetts. One of our goals is to serve the underserved. Hope was the admission ticket to this seminar about how to start and manage a business in Massachusetts. Being Hispanic, it's kind of hard or kind of um, difficult to believe you can achieve, but you first have to start with believing in yourself. For the past decade, the Massachusetts Latino Chamber of Commerce has offered classes on financial literacy, marketing, and legal issues behind owning a business. The Small Business Administration taught a group of prospective barbershop owners, landscapers, and funeral directors about the resources available to them when it comes to applying for loans and making a business plan. From a financial perspective, the, the Latino Latino community is not prospering uh, to the same degree that other communities are. So workshops like this today that can help people start a business and improve their lives is critically important. Small businesses are extremely important to Massachusetts economy. In fact, the SBA says there are more than 615,000 small businesses in Massachusetts, representing 97% of employers. It was a time for these driven individuals to learn and also network in the Hispanic community. We're just basically to uh, learn more about the business end of it, uh, make sure that we're in business longer than a year, and just the financial in and outs that we don't know. After all, in today's competitive jobs market, resources and networking are crucial in helping make anyone's business dreams come true. In Springfield, Kate Walsh, 22 News. The SBA just launched a Spanish version of its website this week. You can find a link on our website at wwlp.com.